Hello, I'm Dr. Hilary Jones, and I've come here to Wellington Grange in Chichester today, which is Colton Care's 20th care home. I'll be shown round by Claire, the home manager. She'll be showing me the accommodation and the other facilities, and I'll be meeting all the other members of staff who will be working here. We entered under the uh, oak porch uh, into this wonderful accommodation. It's open, it's spacious, it's warm, it's welcoming. This is like a five-star hotel. Um, the um, the en-suites in the rooms are state-of-the-art, um, very clean, uh, very easy to use, very practical. All the equipment's there for people who need any uh, extra care, hoists um, and special uh, uh, baths. You've got hairdressing salon, you've got cinema, um, dining, superb dining, um, and um, the accommodation is, is second to none. So once again, I've been blown away really by what's on offer here. 72 beds in total. Um, I'm sure that uh, they'll all be uh, full quite soon after opening because people will come here and see that this is somewhere they, they'd like to stay. Well, in Chichester, I know that there is an older demographic. Uh, there are a lot of people who've uh, retired uh, here, down here in this neck of the woods. And uh, just like the rest of the UK, we have an ageing population. And whilst we have uh, better quality of years now as we get older, nevertheless, uh, our joints and our muscles uh, start to wear out and uh, we slow down. Uh, we might still be compost mentis, uh, but sometimes we need a bit of help. Um, uh, help to just cope with everyday life and to be able to come to uh, somewhere like this in Chichester where uh, all that is done uh, for you but you've still got the freedom to do whatever you want, the, the, the activities that can be organised and provided if you wish to have them, I think is, is a great uh, opportunity. Uh, and I think the fact that Colton Care think about the local community if you look at the pictures on the walls in the corridors here, there are lots of local photographs so that people will know if they've come from the local area to, to Colton Care. They will familiar, be familiar with those pictures and say, I remember that when I was young and I remember walking in those woods or on those hills and having that seascape in front of me. I think all of that is part of making people feel comfortable in their own skin, but also here in, in, in this accommodation, which provides so much for people. I think when people come into a residential home, they might have some negative feelings to start with. After all, there's no place like home. And it gets harder to make changes as you get older. But so many people come to Colton Care and within a very short space of time wonder why they didn't make that move before. And I know lots of the relatives do as well. So it doesn't take a lot of convincing. When you look at the garden here, if, if somebody's interested in gardening, which many older people are, um, the gardens are, are, are very well designed. There are areas that are calm uh, and peaceful. There's fountains, there's um, grass, um, there's walkways, there's everything that you could want. And, and people are given the opportunity to actually do some gardening themselves, whether it's indoors or outdoors, which is really nice, really refreshing. Equally, there are uh, places where people can play cards, play chess, they can go to the library, they can visit the cinema, and of course it's often their choice what they watch. It's a, it's a communal decision and everyone gets an opportunity to, to watch what they want. So I think bringing their home here is important and on that in that vein people can bring any favourite furniture that they wish to bring, favourite pictures, favourite books. Um, people want to hang on to those personal things and here they have the ability to do that. And of course it's not just long-term care that people assume that care homes are all about. Some people will come here for shorter stays, recovering from an operation or from surgery, um, just until they get on their feet, uh, fit enough to go home again. And others of course will see how beneficial this can be for someone living alone, perhaps in isolation, 
um, perhaps um, faced with the challenge of lots of chores to be done, bills to be paid. And to come here and have all that done, looking at that short stay might just encourage them to, to sign on um, more permanently. And certainly, uh, I'll be putting my name down for a place in years to come.